Hey, it in London, how are you? Uh, thanks very much for your comment. Uh, just going to clean that lens there. And uh, thanks very much for your comment. Uh, and not just thanks very much for it, but I mean, obviously, thanks very much for opening up. Um, and I think that you need to know that it's mutual. Not that I would kill myself, but it's mutual that you know, uh, we help each other um, feel better in ourselves just with the simple fact of us being. Uh, so, it's a shame that you haven't done videos yet, uh, but I'm fairly patient on that level. Uh, I'm, I really appreciate every single thing that you've brought into the Peace and Party channel. Um, I wish we had access to uh, a site where we could do polls, like, uh, you know, ask questions and give multi-choice answers, uh, because I think we need that. We need to, we need to have a, a, a community of XXYs um, uh, active, you know, um, on opening themselves up for others' benefit. Uh, and that's essentially what I suppose I'm doing with what I, how I do my videos, is that I'm opening up uh, for other people's benefit, uh, also for my own benefit, because I've yet to look at all my videos, and I will do that maybe when I'm in hospital next time, I have nothing to do, I'll start watching all my videos, um, and learning from myself. Um, so we're all learning from each other, and, uh, you know... Uh, I want people to know that no matter how shitty feeling I am, uh, I am uh, never going to uh, take my own life. Uh, you know, I've been in uh, horrible mind situations in my own mind where I'm telling myself, what is the fucking point? You know, uh, you know that has happened regularly throughout my life. So you could call me suicidal on levels. Um, I don't think most people go through life without thinking of suicide at least once. Um, but, you know, if you're hormonally imbalanced, and that's the crunch point for me, then uh, it's much harder to, uh, to convince yourself of positivity and the possibilities of, of life in a positive way. Uh, very difficult. And I think that there's a lot of um, people out there, forget about XXYs, there's a lot of people out there that are uh, suffering, um, first of all, because they get misdiagnosed by their doctor. Um, and there are a lot of people suffering because this world is not a world of asking somebody, how are you, and then getting a real answer. Uh, it's, it's just a how are you world, and nobody waits around for an answer. Um, in fact, if you go to a party and you're not feeling the best, and you tell somebody, oh, I'm not feeling the best at a party, they obviously don't want to be around you because it's a party situation, and a party is not supposed to be negative, it's supposed to be positive all the time. So it's a bit distressing, really, when you're, when you're feeling off and feeling out of it, and you're surrounded by people who are not feeling out of it, and uh, you're not uh, taken in or given a hug or whatever, you know, people essentially in this world want to ignore negativity um, but you know if you ignore people who are down and out and negative and whatever then you isolate them alienate them and they feel even worse and actually that is the basis behind how you how we grow terrorists because uh, you know we, we, we see somebody's got a point to make we don't want to hear it so they go, oh, you don't want to listen to me anymore? So they say, well, I can't talk anymore, you're not listening to me, what do I have to do to get you to listen to me? You know, um, and help me, blah, blah. Um, and, you know, you can go follow it through from there. I mean, you know, um, I mean, I've even often thought, you know, if this doesn't get better soon, then... I will personally strap shit to myself and blow something up, do you know what I mean? Uh, because that would get attention. Gavin Coleman blew himself up outside the Medical Institute for Genetics and blah 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 because he just was getting told that he was a male when he's fucking XXY. What the fuck is that? If science says an XY is male and an XX is female, 
Then what the fuck are they telling me that I'm a male for? Why the fuck am I being called a male? It's fucking nuts. That is just fucking nuts. <laughs> uh, you have cheered me up a bit in London. Uh, also, anti geekies. Um, you've cheered me up. Um, also, Ellen Farr cheered me up. Um, and. Uh, well, I know there's millions of you out there. Paula loves it. Cheered me up. Um, you know, knowing that all of you people out there who are watching my videos, you cheer me up because you're fucking watching my videos. Um, you know, I have the greatest ideas of videos when I don't have my camera with me. Isn't it just mad the way life works? You know... You want something desperately, you have loads of money for it, but you can't find it. Then when you do find it, you have no money left. That's, that's life, I think, yeah. So we never know, really, what the best road is to take until we've gone down it and found out it is a good road or it's a bad road. And then we've got to go all the way back and go to another road, you know. Um, oh, yeah. Well, I suppose on that level uh, of, of roads and stuff, I would take a road and then I'd take another road and I don't generally go back because I don't like traveling the same um, road over and over you know so uh, I like to move on and so when I get down <clears throat> like I did the other night and last few days I suppose um, you know I talk about it and uh, you know and, I, and, I, and at this stage I video it and uh, you know, I, I've been thinking recently of like, God, what happens if I do get famous, even against my will, I don't want to be famous, but what if I do get famous and then, then I'll be fucked because, uh, you know, I've given off every single part of myself to the world, um, no editing, and uh, I can see myself slightly getting taken advantage of in a psychological, emotional way because people will know how to push my buttons. Um, and I hope that that doesn't happen in the future. I, I kind of trust in a in a better world, to be honest. I do think that we're on the road for a better world. The only problem with our better world dream is um, that with, there are a couple of million dickheads that um, are convinced that uh, wars are the answer and um, that we should just continue to use out-of-date weapons such as bombs, which are not accurate enough. Um, you know, t uh, to threaten other nations, uh, and it's all to do with finances, it's all to do with money, it's all fucking real. They try and pin it on religion, we know damn well it's not about religion. Um, and uh, so it's just, I think, you know, basically I'm a positive person, I'm an optimist. Um, uh, it's been pointed out to me that I've been paranoid by my best friends uh, lately. I haven't been lately paranoid, I've just been paranoid in general over the last while. And they do see a change in me off the testosterone. And I'm more negative thinking, definitely. But inside myself, and in, in the heart that I've grown, uh, I am a positive person, ultimately. And I am strong enough over much, much... Um, I suppose self-affirmation stuff, you know, and over much time of accepting myself the way I am and progressing into the ways that I want to be. I mean, it takes a hell of a lot of time, uh, but it's worth it in the end. And all the problems that come to everybody, they're happening for a reason. Just believe that. They all happen for a reason. You've got to get through them. Uh, and you, you decide how you get through them. But obviously, if anybody out there is going through shit that you know, similar to myself, please, please know that I give a fuck about you, I do care about you, and I, and I, and I want you to know that I, that I will do all I can, um, to, to help you out of yourself, because it's yourself, generally, that tells you that you're fucked, you know, um, and when you feel that inside yourself, you do transmit it out, um, and people get that vibe off you, so it is always important to wake up every day and, and think positive or think of something good and, or smile and um, you know and start the day off well uh, I don't practice what I preach now to be honest with you but that is the best way <laughs> to do it um, anyway that's it look thanks very much for all the support people out there um, really appreciate it um, 
you know, it's it's. Uh, I think Paula loves it. You know, I mean, she's like, um, she's like, um, well, Paula. Let's say Paula is like uh, always trying to keep a happy channel. You know, and that's fine. I I I like that. I mean, of course, it's lovely to go to Paula loves it channel because, uh, you know, it, it is generally upbeat and whatever. You know, and I'm not trying to keep anything upbeat. I'm trying to keep everything just as it is. Um, and uh, and showing uh, all my sides and I so appreciate it in London for you to be uh, caring as well so much and uh, t you know you are a great person and uh, I can't wait to meet you so you know hang in there yourself um, and I'm here with you in spirit always and with everybody else too ciao peace